Welcome to this brief guide on how to manage multiple profiles in Microsoft Edge. Many of us appreciate being able to keep our work lives and personal lives separate, and the same goes for our browsing data. So using multiple profiles in Microsoft Edge is a great way to ensure that your content stays separate. Here on my desktop, I currently have two different windows in Microsoft Edge open, one of which is signed into my work profile, and the secondary one is signed in to my personal profile. If you're currently only signed in with one, you can click on your profile photo, and in the drop-down menu that pops up, you can click on the button that says add a profile. This will give you the option to add additional profiles. You can have as many work or personal accounts as you wish, and they are all separate. Now I'm gonna cancel this one, and some ask, how do I ensure that my content stays separate? So what we can do is we can click on our profile photo and select the option that says manage profile settings. This will take us to the settings page where we wanna select the option that says profile preferences. Selecting this gives us a few of our default options and then some exception options down the bottom which we'll cover later. The first of which is the automatic profile switching. This allows Edge to automatically toggle between the profiles when it recognizes a work or personal link you also have the option in the case for a work account to be able to have Edge automatically sign you in using your work credentials. And then the last option there is the ability to set a default for where links that are clicked from external applications open. By default, it is set to open up the last used browser that you have. But if you wish, you can choose to select either the personal or work so that all links clicked on in other applications will open in a default profile. In my case, I'm gonna leave that as last used. But if I want to, I can actually set exceptions on a site-by-site -site basis, simply by clicking the Add button. Now, in this case, I'm just going to jump in and put in the Spotify URL, and then I have an option to choose whether or not this particular website switches or doesn't switch from the browser that I have currently open. I'm going to tell this to switch, and I'm going to say that anytime I open up the Spotify URL, always switch to my personal profile. Now that I've got those settings set up, I'm gonna open up a new tab, and in the address bar, I'm just gonna paste in the Spotify URL and hit enter. And what you'll see is that it's automatically opened up that in my personal profile instead of my work profile. This is a great way to ensure that certain websites can be kept off limits from your work profile, or vice versa, and have it set so that all of your Microsoft 365 applications always open in your work profile. And that, is how you manage multiple profiles in Microsoft Edge. I hope you found this tip extremely useful and I'll catch you in my next video. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more content like this, be sure to check out the channel. And if you like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button.